Today on the channel, rebuilding the collection number four, Scarlet on Way I Got It Figured. The Way I Got It Figured. Hey, out there in action figure land, we I got a figure to share back with another G.I. Joe Classified Series review. This time, Scarlet. Um, I picked this figure up on eBay. Um, it was supposed to be uh, the OG version, not the revision, which you can clearly see this is the revision here. Um, and I attempted to contact the seller. First, first of all, it's unopened, so, you know, there's that, but... I contact. I wanted to contact the seller. eBay won't upload my picture to show that it's the wrong one, even though the description shows that it's an actual. You know, in the description, the picture was for the non-revision version, the original version, which is the one I kind of prefer. But I decided I'm just going to keep this one because I can't even contact the seller. And by the time I do all of that and everything. You know, whatever. It's just whatever. This, this, this will just be my scarlet, and, and that'll be the end of it. So here she is. There's not anything special going on that people don't already know. Um, you know, it's one of the original classified series figures. So I am going to go over it very quickly. In the package, you can see she's got her three dives and her crossbow. Phil Noto did the artwork for this um, box. There she is, jumping down on the alley viper. Always like that. OG box back. And she is number five in the series with four intelligence, two um, arrow weapons, three martial artists, and four classified. All right, we're gonna get Scarlet out, take a look at it real fast. Let's get on with it. All right, so here's Scarlet on the turntable with her accessories, uh, three knives and a crossbow, and of course her bandolier type backpack thing is already on her. Um, Scarlet is a character that needs no introduction. She's one of the original Joes. Um, I don't think that they ever made a female that's a superior character um, to her. She's the best. Um, you know, multiple black belts with uh, you know, from the age of nine and um, just, you know, list of credits going all the way, you know, rap sheet, so to speak, uh, as long as career criminals, sniper school, marine sniper school, special forces, uh, special air service school, ranger school. I mean, you know, she's not to be messed with. Um, and so, you know, as a uh, as a member of GI Joe, to me she is a she's an essential character. So, in rebuilding my collection, obviously I did want to get her in there, but as I have to sort of slow roll, um, slow roll these 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 purchases, you know, I search high and low for the correct version that I want. And while this is not the correct version that I want, there's nothing wrong with this version. A lot of people actually like this one better. It's fine. Um, initially, I was thinking perhaps to have the original body and the revision head. Um, but actually, I kind of like the original head. She has freckles on that version and everything, and this one doesn't. Um, so, you know, I don't know. A lot of people don't like it. I, I don't know what's going on with that, but, you know, I'm cool with it either way. So there's a close-up. And there she is. Head sculpt. Um, I don't know. She might have the best looking face sculpt of all of the, um, you know, females, or at least 
uh, makeup job because I do think in some cases it's the makeup job that that makes the portrait not necessarily look the best. Um, they sort of realistic up her colors on this version and that's all cool. But there's something about the original that just sort of speaks to me in a in a more in an accurate uh, accuracy kind of standpoint but I don't know it's it's all subjective really um, so yeah so I'm gonna get her stuff on and then we'll look at her on a turntable with her with her equipment so give me a sec to do that all right here's Scarlet geared up um, you know pretty simple really her, her, her knives go in the backpack there um, the two matching ones and then she's got a smaller one on the front and her crossbow and she's all all ready to take down uh, Cobra or shoot Cobra Commander in the hand with a crossbow whatever you want to do with her um, so yeah obviously an original figure has the little weird communications device thing there or not weird but you know let's say modern and and she's looking good. I didn't want to have her with like snake eyes or Duke in the in the you know video. Scarlet in my world always has been able to stand alone. She know you know she's not defined by those characters. She's 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 a badass in her own right. And uh, I'm glad to have her back in the collection. So uh, final thoughts on. Scarlet, G.I. Joe Classified, Revision. Um, I'm going to give her an 8 out of 10. Um, she's an essential character. Obviously, she's in the original um, style of G.I. Joe Classified, which was a little bit more out there. So, you know, I kind of detract a little bit um, for that. But, you know, she's definitely... A good figure and, and and still fits in with the line so there you go all right guys uh, once again thank you for watching my videos um, and uh, if you're new to the channel obviously like subscribe and comment um, if you're looking for more co content from me you can hit the notifications button and be alerted uh, as soon as I put up a new video so um, everybody who's been watching, you know, you know what it is. You know, I'm rebuilding my collection. Um, looking for deals here and there to, to, to get it done. And uh, I actually have found a couple other figures uh, for really good deals. Um, I may not do videos for every single figure, but you know, we'll see, I don't know. I do want to, uh, sort of catalog all of my all of my Joes in a, in a form of a video review it doesn't matter how old they are or whatever that I'm not doing it for uh, recency points or whatever you know I'm not trying to be the first it doesn't bother me if I'm the last so another we're building the collection video in the hopper and uh We'll see you guys on the next video. I believe what will be next is a Marvel Legends, Marvel Legends video. So, um, hmm, I might be wrong about that. Uh, there will be a Marvel Legends video this week, but I believe the next video on the schedule will be a uh, Star Wars Mandalorian review, which if you've watched my previous Mandalorian review you already know once per week I'm doing those so yeah Star Wars then uh, Marvel Legends all right that'll do it everybody stay safe um, just know that you know things happen um, they, they have things happen you know I was just uh, told about somebody um, you know, jumping off a bridge, so it's kind of an off-putting thing to hear. 
Um, so, you know, just, you know, hug your loved ones, man. You don't know what's going on with them. You know, I kind of, I want the best, you know, the best for everybody. Um, so, yeah. All right. See you on the next video. Peace.